Gani from Intestures, Lumayati, Philippines. Our verse for today is taken from the book of Matthew chapter 5 verses 23 and 24. So if you are offering your gift at the altar and they remember that your brother has something against you, leave your gift there before the altar and go. First be reconciled to your brother and then come and offer your gift. Jesus emphasizes here how to love and live peacefully with others. And he wanted us to have a humble heart. How can you say, I love you, Lord, but then you don't love your neighbors? That's why Jesus says here, leave your gifts, go, reconcile, come and offer your gifts. And there are five commands here. First is you have to leave. You have to go, reconcile, come, and offer your gifts. Jesus is not after of our gift. What matters to him is the matter of the heart. He sees our hearts and reads our mind. He wants us to have a humble heart, a forgiving heart. He doesn't like an arrogant heart. He doesn't like an unforgiving heart. We have to reject the love of Jesus to others because Jesus died for them too. And God wanted them to be in his kingdom. We are the ambassadors of love, and we are the ambassadors of peace. So we must worship God through our actions or deeds, to our words, because through this, we can be a blessing to other people, especially to those who have no Jesus yet. We can become a blessing to our classmates, friends, relatives, to our family, to our co-workers, or our office mates, and even to people who likes to pull us down. Here in the Philippines, we call them contrabina. So brothers and sisters in Christ, we can impact people's lives by living a life of a true servant and a true child of God. So whatever we do and whatever we think, we must see to it that it will bring glory and praises to our God. So be like Jesus. <laughs>